Get ready for the ultimate Hollywood showdown that's about to unfold. It's Ryan Gosling versus Cillian Murphy, and we're diving into their luxurious lifestyles, eye-popping fortunes, and everything in between. These two silver screen titans have not only graced us with their exceptional acting, but have also stacked up some serious green along the way. So if you're all set for a thrilling clash of the A-listers, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, because we're about to unravel who truly breaks the bank between these two sensational actors. Grab your popcorn, get comfy, and let's jump straight into the glitz, glamour, and jaw-dropping extravagance that define the worlds of Ryan Gosling and Cillian Murphy. Round 1. Movies. Ladies and gentlemen, let's ignite this showdown by delving into the silver screen extravaganzas that have not only captivated us, but also substantially fattened the bank accounts of these stellar actors. Ryan Gosling, famed for his heartthrob charisma, etched his name in history with blockbuster gems like The Notebook, Crazy Stupid Love, La La Land, and Blade Runner 2049. And hold on to your seats, because these roles didn't just create a buzz, they generated some seriously impressive figures. Picture this, a cool million for The Notebook, an enticing six million for Crazy Stupid Love, an applause-worthy eight million for La La Land, a staggering 10 million for his futuristic performance in Blade Runner 2049, and a massive 12.5 million for his role as Ken in the box office hit Barbie. It's raining cash, folks. Now, let's shift our spotlight to the magnetic force that is Cillian Murphy. While his name resonates with the gritty allure of peaky blinders, he's not one to be boxed in. Brace yourselves for his superhero escapades in Batman Begins, The Dark Knight, and The Dark Knight Rises. And mark my words, his accolades weren't the only thing soaring, his paychecks were soaring too. But here's the kicker. His salary for Peaky Blinders episodes skyrocketed to a staggering $2 million. Yes, you heard that right. Those aren't just applause lines. Those are mega digits on the financial stage. And as if that's not enough, Murphy's financial reign only continues to thrive. In his latest movie, Oppenheimer, he reportedly pocketed a whopping $10 million for his portrayal of J. Robert Oppenheimer in the hit film. Moreover, it's estimated that since his breakthrough in the Batman films starting in 2005, he's been raking in substantial salaries, ranging from three to five million dollars for lead roles. These two titans aren't just Hollywood royalty, they're financial dynamos, setting new standards for silver screen success. Round two, car collections. Now, let's shift gears and dive into the awe-inspiring world of their car collections. Ryan Gosling, a man of many talents and passions, has a garage that's as diverse as his roles. From the eco-friendly Toyota Prius to the classic 1973 Chevelle Malibu that showcased his charm in the movie Drive, he's got a ride for every mood. And if that wasn't enough, his collection also boasts the sleek BMW Z8, the powerful Ford Mustang with a 5.0-liter V8 engine, the sophisticated Range Rover Vogue, and the iconic Porsche 911. It's like a showroom of luxury that's not just for display, but also for living life in the fast lane. On the flip side, we have the ever-enigmatic Cillian Murphy, who proves that his taste extends beyond just the silver screen. From his striking red Lamborghini Urus, a lavish gift to himself worth a jaw-dropping $600,000, to the thoughtfully chosen Audi A8 that he gifted to his wife Yvonne McGuinness, his car collection is a testament to his exquisite choices. The lineup doesn't stop there. There's the Porsche Macan, the BMW, W X7, the Mercedes GLC, the stunning Ferrari Roma, the fierce Nissan GTR, and the sleek Jaguar F-Pace. Each car in his collection is a reflection of his personality, making it a testament to his style and discerning taste. Whether it's Ryan's mix of power and luxury or Cillian's symphony of sophistication, their cars are nothing short of showstoppers. Round three, real estate. All right. Let's pull back those curtains and step into the world of opulent abodes that these illustrious actors call their sanctuaries. 
Ryan Gosling, who effortlessly dazzles on screen, takes his real estate prowess up a notch. We're talking about the iconic Buckhead Mansion in Atlanta, a place where celebrities roam and movies find their magic. But that's just the start. Ryan's real estate portfolio doesn't hold back either. Among its treasures is the breathtaking Los Feliz Mansion, which gracefully changed hands for a cool $5 million in 2021. Seems like Ryan's knack for choosing awe-inspiring properties rivals his impeccable acting chops. Now, onto the other side of this real estate battle. Enter the enigmatic Cillian Murphy, a man known for embracing a minimalist lifestyle that beautifully intertwines with nature's embrace. His Dublin beachfront haven isn't just any property, it's a statement valued at a whopping 10 million. This seven-bedroom Victorian-style mansion is more than just walls and a roof. It's a retreat, an oasis of tranquility amidst the chaos of the world. With an unwavering appreciation for the great outdoors, Cillian's minimalist lifestyle shines through in his choice of residence. So, whether it's the allure of lavish glamour or the serenity of minimalist elegance, both actors truly excel in crafting their own versions of the high life. Round 4. Net Worth all right, folks, let's dive into the dollars and cents of this showdown. Ryan Gosling's bank account isn't just impressive, it's practically a treasure chest. With a net worth of approximately $70 million as of July 2023, he's riding high on the waves of his diverse ventures. Besides his acting prowess, he's a man of many hats, from owning the production house Arcana and producing films to scoring brand endorsement deals with powerhouses like Tag Heuer and Gucci. But that's not all. His real estate transactions, including the jaw-dropping $5 million sale of his Los Feliz mansion, have significantly contributed to his financial empire. And let's not forget his philanthropic side, with donations to organizations like PETA and Mercy for Animals. It's clear that Ryan's not just a Hollywood heartthrob, he's a financial force to be reckoned with. Cillian Murphy, on the other hand, might have a slightly lighter wallet. But don't be fooled, it's still loaded. With a net worth of around $20 million, he's making his mark as a versatile actor who's not afraid to shine in diverse roles. With a multi-million dollar salary, he certainly knows how to command the big bucks. But what's truly remarkable about Cillian is his modest lifestyle, a stark contrast to his substantial wealth. He's proof that you don't always need to flash the cash to live the good life. So whether it's Ryan's empire building or Cillian's understated elegance, these financial heavyweights have truly shown that Hollywood success can translate into serious financial prowess. And there you have it, folks. The ultimate clash between the charismatic Ryan Gosling and the enigmatic Cillian Murphy. From their big screen triumphs to their opulent estates, luxurious car collections, and eye-watering net worths, these Hollywood titans have shown us that success comes in various forms. Whether it's Ryan's diverse ventures and philanthropic efforts, or Cillian's minimalist elegance and powerhouse performances, both have carved their paths to financial stardom. As we wrap up this showdown, we'd love to hear your thoughts. Who do you think really breaks the bank, Ryan or Cillian? Drop your comments below and don't forget to hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed this deep dive into their lifestyles. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe because we've got more exciting celebrity face-offs and lifestyle explorations coming your way. Thanks for tuning in and until next time, stay fabulous.